back to the channel how you all doing if you're new here you're welcome to the channel my name is lavika it's so nice to meet you please do what to like the video do what to subscribe to the channel do what to know drop your comments in the comment section do not forget to set on your notification bell after subscribing do what to check out my previous video you know you've not really missed much my OGs, thank you so much for coming back thank you so much for tuning in i really appreciate you so on today's episode is just a basic question like how long do you think couples should date or people should date before getting married like do you believe in a long time dating relationship or a short time dating relationship or you know like it just varies how long and i'm just going to be giving my opinion on the long and short and whatever it is i'm going to be giving my opinion and that's it so disclaimer it is just my opinion so don't come in the comment section and be dragging me left and right it is just my own opinion so first of all i feel like people should not have a specific year they should date for before getting married i feel like marriage is decision that has to do with the couple it has nothing to do with we as an outsider it has something to do with them as the couple i feel like people should not pressure other people to get married because oh, maybe because this girl and this guy they dated for six years what are they doing why are they not married what are this is that, that basically people that dated for that long are people that maybe they were like secondary school sweetheart so they made it in secondary school they obviously you don't expect them to marry when they were in secondary school like what do you expect um uh, okay when they end up university and most of the time university courses are four years okay you don't expect them to get married when they are still schooling both of them don't, they don't even have a job so how do you expect them to feel so probably okay they studied for four year courses and they've been together since secondary school let's say they started dating as ss2 and they finished secondary school after four years that's um six years already gone then they're thinking of serving they're thinking of that's how you see that some people would date for more than seven eight years before they get married i don't advise that because i feel like that's extremely too long but at the same time it's not our right to decide whether they should get married or not it is not our right to let to remind them that it's already late like it got to say that my life like people are always telling me when i guess going to get married when i get to like it's a question like it's yeah we know we understand but it shouldn't be like we should force people to get married when they're not ready to get married i always tell people that marriage is not something that somebody can just jump into it's not something that normally maybe when your spouse offends you just carry your bag and say do talk to me and just end the call and not talk to the person for a while and this and that Marriage is something that even the person's annoying you, you both are going to be in your faces. You guys are going to be looking at each other like this without like having anywhere to go to. Marriage is something that you are stuck with that person. Like this dog is barking. Like I literally feel like going out and beating the hell out of it. I don't get which why it's barking. So marriage is something that you just cannot like rush into there's a story of this lady that is trending online currently i, I think she learned yesterday when the lady said she did it as spouse for four days and they got engaged the next day like what yeah and do you know the funny thing is that they've been married for five years and i don't believe in oh, how long it is you could have dated a partner for five years and you guys would get married and within a year you guys are divorced so i don't believe in how long you guys have dated i don't believe in you guys should date for 20 years 10 years 15 years 8 years before you guys get married no i just believe in when you are ready you shouldn't be pressured into because of dated especially for a longer period of time i am supposed to be married by now no it is not about i am supposed to be married by now it is about i am ready i want to it is time but it is not about how long you guys dated like people ask me this question a lot guys people ask me like how long should people date before they get married like you don't have any reason to be saying oh i must date for five years before i get married to this person i must date for three years before i get married to this person i must date for this years but it is not about that it's about understanding each other it's about knowing that okay okay i think we are good now i think we are financially buoyant because marriage is not something that you just jump into when you're not financially buoyant you cannot just do that because that love that is shocking you will clear once you guys get married you clear pa, 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 pa. especially when you now have children everything will start you will start seeing things so before you get married i actually feel like marriage is beyond just the love you look at other things before you just get married to the person that is me i'm not talking about any other person i'm talking about my own opinion i just feel like before i get married to somebody it is not really about it's not it's not all about the love it's, it's about the love but it is not all about the love 
like there are some other things i need to consider before getting married to that person with all sincerity i feel like she did for four to five years before you get married and i have my reasons one of my reasons is that is that it makes you to know the person well it makes you to understand each other better it makes you to know your dislike your faults your weaknesses your strength in each other it makes you to know it makes you to understand how to set you argument because when you are married to somebody, you cannot get angry today and say you are packing and moving back to your parents' house. It's not possible. You can't say, oh, this person has vexed me today. I don't want to get married to this person. I'm moving away. I'm moving. Once you are married, you are married. Especially when you have kids. You have to forfeit a lot of things. You have to think about a lot of things. You have to... So basically, to get married is not about how long you've dated. You can date somebody for six months, one year, and get married the next year. And that does not mean that you're going to divorce the next year. It doesn't mean that. And you can also marry for a, date for a shorter period of time and still divorce. It all depends on you both. So I feel like dating for a longer period of time helps you to understand each other, helps you to get used to each other, helps you to know your strength, helps you to know your weakness. When you date for a longer period of time, it helps you to read your partner's emotion. That is just my point of view. Like, I don't have to necessarily tell you everything. I can be in a garden. I don't have to tell you anything. Just do it appear. You can already tell what is going on. You can already tell what I need. You can already tell what I want at that moment. That is why it is good for you to, you know, I feel like it's necessary for you to date for a longer period of time. I'm not saying it's a must, but I just feel like before you get married, you should at least date this for only three, four, five years. Even statistically wise, it says that you should do that because it helps your marriage. Like, I just feel like dating for a longer period of time also help you guys to, you know, have a good communication skill because at that point who thought you want the wife it is it also makes you guys to be free with each other and likes and all that and all that so basically that's my point of view anyway that's why i said i should come and drop here i want us to communicate in the comment section like how long do you think people should date before they get into marriage like before they get married before they say okay they won't stop being a family how long do you think how long do you estimate can you tell me the reason why you think that way so that we will both you know learn from each other because as for me i feel like the longer relationship period of time is better because it helps you to build relationship or it helps you guys to know know each other well get over arguments easily know your weaknesses and your points and everything i feel that's the reason why i feel like a longer like a, like four to five years it's okay for you before you get into marriage so basically that's it so tell me your idea or your opinion in the comment section let me know what you think let me know what you feel however it is thank you so much for watching this video please do not forget to like the video do not forget to subscribe to the channel do not forget to love, don't drop your comment do not forget to check out my previous video if you have never checked my previous video i dropped a video i'm going to be linking the video right now right now right now right now so that you guys can see the video click on that video immediately this video is over already so thank you guys bye i love you